a new home for Snowball. Good King Max had too many horses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One of them was little and white. Her name was Snowball. King Max loved his little white horse, but he could not keep her. I must find a new home for Snowball, said King Max. But how shall I find it? He sat and he thought. He thought and he sat and he thought of something. He made a sign and he put it on his big gate. It said, there's the big gate. I will give my little white horse to the home that has the best words for her. Words. The people came running. Best words, they said. Which words are her best words? A boy and a girl came running. His name was Will Brown. Her name was Jill Brown. They loved the little white horse. The little white horse loved Will and Jill. She loves us, said Will. How I wish Snowball could come and live with us, Jill said. We can read and we can ride, but how can we know which words are the best words for a little white horse? They were very sad. I know, said a man. I know the best words for a little white horse. And he ran home to write them. I know, said a woman. I know the best words for a little white horse. And she ran home to write them. And one by one, all the people said they knew the best words for a little white horse. And they ran home to write them. But Will Brown and Jill Brown did not run home. They sat and they thought. They thought and they sat, but they could not think of anything. King Max took his little white horse through the big gate. He was going to find a new home for Snowball. Look, King, look, cried a man in a field. Here is where her best words are. The king looked and Snowball looked. They saw the sign. Please eat the grass. Those are nice words, said King Max, but they are not the right words. Look, King, look, said a woman by her house. Here is where her best words are. The King looked and Snowball looked. They saw the sign. There is no place like home. Those are nice words, said King Max, but they are not the right words. All the people said, look, King, look, here, 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 here is where her best words are. The King looked and Snowball looked. They looked and they looked. Can you read these signs? What does that say? Horse house. Apples are free if you live with me. I like horses. Fresh hay every day. Breakfast in bed. All those words are not very nice words, said King Max. But they are not the best words for my little white horse. I have not found a new home for Snowball after all. And he was very sad. The black horse looks sad, the king looks sad, and Snowball looks sad too. Will and Jill were very sad. They had tried and tried, but they could not think of anything. I can only think of my best words, Will said, and he wrote, Will Brown. 
Those are the best words for you, said Jill, and these are the best words for me. And she wrote Jill Brown. Those were their names. Will looked at Jill, and Jill looked at Will, when all at once they knew the best words for the little white horse. Will and Jill put a sign on the door of their warm, dry barn. It said, Snowball. The king looked, Snowball looked, and then the little white horse smiled. Do you think he liked those words? Yes, 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 cried King Max. This is the home where her best words are. Snowball's best words are her name, because those words are her very own. King Max gave his little white horse to Will and Jill. Snowball was very happy. Will and Jill were very happy. Oh, Snowball, they said. Now we can be together always. Hooray, said all the people. Hooray, said good King Max. Let's have a party. And they did. The end.